See, what Mr. Fountain don't understand is that Texas is a very different state than every other state in the union when it comes to these types of things. So just let them talk. You don't have to respond to them. I don't. I didn't invite them here. He invited himself here. So you just let them stay here. So if he think the issues that we talk about within the space are based on nothing and that if we just continued on the black feminist path, that that would help all black men within society. OK. He's going to have to prove that. But OK, you have to let the gender identity extremists be him. No, dude, let him stay. Let him stay. Let him stay. I didn't invite him here. He knows himself what he's doing is illegal. But let him stay. Because if I spent my whole life in school, I never went out and created a business or anything else like that. I'd be pretty damn upset with myself, too, if I seen some, some guy like Man Tomorrow doing the shit that he should have did in his life in his early 20s and everything else. I didn't become a lifelong student to be out here, to be under the black feminist heel and thumb, edging for a job writing when he can't even defend his ideas. He can't even come out and debate his ideas, an intellectual who can't debate his ideas. To include not filing tax returns, I could tell you that. <laughs> yeah, they work for part-time. They ain't really got no money. <laughs> well, if they're going to school for history <laughs> and they've done nothing about the bloods, the crips, the vice lords, the gangsters, family creation, yeah, I would have to say you've done nothing with your life. Yeah, I, w I, w I would have to say that. And it tells with, that, with the tax returns that you actually have... Um, <laughs> filed that you have done anything with your life. You're the one, Mr. Founder, who don't want to debate your actual ideas and topics, not me. You actually think the greatest threat to black America is not letting black women have their way. What type of person would think something like that? So you cyber stalk people online, going to their Facebook, cherry picking information, to gaslight the actual women that you think you care about and the flag of my channel and all that type of shit. Which is fine. But I'm something when I turn the camera off, though. Are you something when you turn the camera off? You're not going to be a CJ King once you graduate from that school. You know that, right? We don't need history majors right now in America. We don't need history majors who want men to be quiet about the issues in actual black society and life, man. We, we don't need that. So Mr. Fountain here really thinks he's not cyber stalking people. He really thinks this is not harassment. He really thinks that, that he can keep getting away with this. But man, I'm going to holler at you about February next year, though. It, it, it's not going to be now. 